If what you're wearing is not sustainable, take it off. That was the message behind a Brisbane fashion parade last night. Undress Brisbane was a showcase of clothing, manufacturing and recycling, which transformed a multi-level car park into a gala fashion house. And a warning, this story contains flash photography. Undress Brisbane features labels that organisers say are ethical, promote fair trade, are organic, recycled or produce zero waste. Di Stitt imports from Africa and goes there once a year to check on working conditions and factory practices. I'm given pretty much free reign to wander around the factory uh, accompanied and I look at um, how things are going there and you know, opportunity to talk to people, ask questions and check out what's happening. 22-year-old designer Alexandra Maguire uses every square millimetre of fabric in her swimwear designs. I designed the prints and placed them onto my pattern pieces on the computer before I got them printed onto fabric. So that way I could place where exactly I wanted. I could place um, all my pattern pieces really close together. More than 500 people have gathered in this concrete car park to see what this sustainable fashion business is all about. Undress Brisbane hopes patrons will leave here though with a new desire to purchase clothing which has been manufactured using ethical and fair trade standards. You have to be open to, to wearing not what everyone else is wearing. So be able to be creative when you op shop or when you swap clothes with friends or stepping outside that um, expected mainstream look. Emerging and established designers were on show. Some are manufacturing locally while others are importing. It's really about bringing sustainable employment, ongoing employment for people in Africa. And by continually marketing their product, these entrepreneurs hope they're improving lives. Craig Berkman, ABC News, Brisbane.